Hallelujah to Jesus. We give God a praise. Let God be glorified forever in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you. Please, family, like this video. Just subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you as you do that in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Glory above Father. Child of God, you are fired up for the Lord. In fact, you are on fire for the Lord. The things that used to stop you, they cannot stop you anymore. There is a lot of bitterness now because they see that you are fired up. <laughs> I love one of my members who always tell me, Evangelist, we need more members. <laughs> we need more fire. I mean, <laughs> they say, Evangelist, we need more fire. I say, we pray for strength. <laughs> we pray for strength to speak more fire because that fire is very needed. So we can, there's a time for everything. So the fire is very, very needed because fire is a way that God always uses. To come true for his people hallelujah glory to jesus <laughs> glory about father you are fired up for the lord the things that used to stop you child of god those things cannot stop you anymore hallelujah there is a song that say great things since i know the lord great things since i know the lord yes great things since i know the lord it is a great thing since I know the Lord. <laughs> the thing I used to do, I do them no more. You know, when you are fired up for the Lord, there are some certain things that you used to do, you don't do them anymore. So that is how fired up you are. When you are fired up for the Lord, you become unstoppable. And a believer told me one day, he said, we can uproot the mountain with our hands if the mountain refuses to move. <laughs> me, I love people who can pray well, who can pray like warriors. You understand? <laughs> he said, we can uproot the mountain. If we are saying mountain move, mountain refuses to move. Yes, we can uproot the mountain and move it by, by ourselves, you know, <laughs> and break it down. <laughs> because God has already given us the sword. He said, Put on the whole armor of the Lord. So he has given us the armor. All we need to do is to put them on and break everything that needs to break. Child of God, you are fired up for the Lord. Do you understand? When you are fired up for the Lord, you become unstoppable and you are recognized even by devil. Devil know that you are a problem to them. They know that you are a problem to them because when you are fired up, you are on a journey to rescue others, not just about you so you are on a journey to make sure you rescue others as well you want to bring people with you that also will be fired up for the lord because in this generation god is raising an army for himself you know you want to bring people you also want to pray for people you also want people to know more about god these are the things that threatens demon you can be born again and just be doing your own they will not too much worry about you but when you now start to say you want to bring your family into salvation, you want to bring people into, into, into salvation, you want people to know God, you want people to be fired up as well, you want people to, to know that this God is a God that never fails, that is where the problem is. All hell will start breaking loose because they have so many people in their captivity. They have so many people in their cage. So anyone that dare to come up and said. I want these people in your cage to be free. They come for that person. Yes, child of God, they come for that person. I pray the Lord will help us in the name of Jesus. Child of God, you are unstoppable on a mission to also rescue others, not just about you. And the Lord will help you to rescue as many that he wants you to rescue to his glory in the name of Jesus. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remember your sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again.